there! We decided to open our inbox just for fun. Tumblr's in the description. Feel free to ask us anything! Yeah, yeah, whatever. Let's get this over with. Come on, Kara, don't be a grump. Let's go! <sighs> and please remember to support our artist, SciShow. Thank you! What do you do when one of you gets sick? I never get sick, human! But if Frisk gets sick, I usually put nice cream on her. Works like 10% of the time. Um, sweetie. Shh, trust me, this will do the trick. Wait, are you two dating? <laughs> <laughs> Would you kiss a ghost? Uh. <clears throat> no. Hello. Howdy. <laughs> you have issues, Kara. Serious issues. We're all mad here. Where are your friends? What do you guys normally do when you are not together? By the way, I love your blog and your art style. Yeah. <laughs> we visit each other a few times a week, too. Kara never seems to want to come with me, though. So it's one of the few times we're not together. I don't really know what she does. Kara, you should hang out with somebody other than Frisk. Is there anybody else you'd feel comfortable with? <laughs> Come on, Kara. <laughs> with your mother. <laughs> Still visit her often. Your eyes are so pretty! Can you show us both of them? Um... Uh... So, what happened the last time you two went to Timmy Village? Uh... Kara? OMG! Frinzel Bouncer Human to Tem for 10 gold! What? I don't remember. I only remember being suddenly knocked out. Kara, could you give Frisk a little kiss on the cheek? Uh... <laughs> I'm sorry, Kara, kiss Frisk again, please. Mm. Mm. Uh. Mm. Have you two tried soul touching? Uh. She did it to me once. <gasps> Kara, you should touch Frisk's soul again, I swear this is for research, this is for research, man! Whoa, why the blushing, Kara? Did the soul touching have unexpected consequences? Hmm? Uh. <laughs> uh. Uh. Have a pick of Kara in that sleeveless of hers. <laughs> Here you go. Huh? I think you have pretty eyes, Kara. What do you think, Frisk? Uh. Y yes. <laughs> I think so too. Did the soul touching hurt Frisk? Is is that why Kara's upset? <laughs> Kara, we've been over this. It didn't hurt that badly. What would you guys wear out to a classy dinner date? <laughs> <laughs> she always looks so cute in skirts. What music do you listen to? Now on M tunes for 1G. Kara, you're the kind that find her very sexy, but wouldn't ever be able to tell that to Frisk's face, huh? I dare you. Frisk. Hmm? I uh think you're stupid. Uh, did I do something wrong? We already saw sleeveless Kara. But what about sleeveless frisk? <laughs> oh man, this feels weird. I don't usually wear sleeveless. <laughs> Kiara, why are you so shy with frisk's body? Aren't you two basically twins? She's just... I just find her so... SEXY! <laughs> How is everyone dealing with frisk wanting to help Kara? Oh, the kid's happy, so I'm rooting for him. Still a little sour at Kara, though. She's trying to be good. The evil human is not so evil now! Red Eyes is awesome! She makes a great sparring partner! Uh, oh, yeah! She's been great, so we're cool with her! Kara's changed so much since she was saved. Everyone's learning to forgive her, even if she doesn't forgive herself. To Kara and Frisk, how did you two fall in love in the first place? <laughs> 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 
What? <sighs> you can be saved too. him back. Frisk, quick! Akira! She's feeling all her grief again! The poor thing is crying! <laughs> I'm here. I'm here. It's okay. I think Kara sexy than frisk. <laughs> Sometimes the purest light is one found in the deepest darkness. Persevere, Kara. You were the hope of all monsters once. You're the hope of hope itself now, for dearest frisk. Mm. <laughs> I know it's you, Asgore. <laughs> Let's all go to the beach! Honestly, both ladies are equally sexy. Hell, they're both equally beautiful, if you ask me. I, I, I mean, I gotta go. They're about to head over. Wanna peek? Hooray! Ten pick best suit for human! Lamau, <laughs> are you okay, Kara? I'm fine. Rated our question! Have you two had sex? Uh, Frisk! It's been a long time, Frisk and Kara. Howdy! <laughs> G give me the reader. That's enough for today, Kara. Let's get some sleep. Yeah. So, when are Frisk and Kara getting hitched? I'm pretty sure Esco wants some grandkitties. Is Varen on the table for you two anytime soon? Uh. <laughs> No, we haven't really thought about it yet. We're the happiest we are. Fisk, for I and the entire fandom, I demand you to tickle Gara. Uh, tickle, uh, tickle! Uh, <laughs> hey, Frisk. Gara thinks you're sexy. Uh, and his uh, name is John C. <laughs> <laughs> I'm pretty sure Frisk's weapon against Kara is her eyes. I bet when Kara doesn't want to do something, Frisk just has to open her eyes. Can I hug you, Kara? I'm not hugging you. <laughs> Anything for you, Frisk. <laughs> Kara. It's only a matter of time until you kill Frisk, too. Soon you'll wonder what you will feel like to kill her. You'll wonder if you could. That's all you'll know how to do, isn't it? I've changed. I wouldn't do such a thing. All this time, and yet you still haven't found peace. You know why, don't you? You still hate yourself.
What if they styled each other's hair? How adorable could that be, Colin 3? <laughs> oh, Frisk. Frisk, why can't you show us both your eyes at the same time? So, Frisk, I've noticed that in a few of your posts, it looks like your eye is glowing like Sans does sometimes. Is that just an effect of the light, or have you learned how to use low-level magic? Also, heads up, Kara! Toss is a chocolate bar at Kara. Because I promised Kara she would be the only one to see them both. It pulls her back from genocide mode. It's not magic or anything. It's just my determination. Asriel throws chocolate from above. Uh, where are these coming from? I've noticed that when Kara's sleeveless, she's got some muscles on her arms. Does she work out? And what do you think about that, Frisk? She's <sighs> doing great, Red Eyes! Uh, uh, well, it's healthy, and, uh, it makes her look... So, is Kara slowly getting used to Flowey's presence? Kara, you're not, not even, even trying. trying! I'm counting, counting on you here! here. <laughs> Get, Get the, the tail! tail. I, I fainted! <laughs> yeah. What is it that Kara is often drinking? <sighs> Want some? How much does spider cider cost? Pretty cheap, actually. Frisk always gets it for me for 15. What? I'm curious. What do you guys like to eat? Grillby's Burgers! He has the best recipe! Uh... All proceeds go to real spiders. When's the wedding, guys? <laughs> <laughs> I told you guys we're not getting married! Uh... How did you do it, Kara? Even if you change, humanity will never change. Even if you do everything in your power to please others, there will still be those who just want to see you suffer. Waking up, knowing that you have to go through another day of hell. Sometimes I wish I never woke up at all. You have the determination to bleed for the ones you love, and in return they just suck you dry. What's the point in going on if the light at the end of the tunnel is just an oncoming train? <sighs> Here's something simple that most people fail to do. Keep moving forward. I don't care if it hurts or if it's scary or any of that crap. You don't give up when you lose. Okay? Asriel throws memes from above! Asriel throws memes from above! Got a Piper Pepe! Got a Hyper Pepe! <laughs> Suck my ass! Suck my ass! <laughs> I'm curious, what do you guys like to eat? Pussy. <laughs> <laughs> And my suffering side is gonna hate me. So, Kara, you're on top, right? You people don't need to know this! I've seen some pretty frisky stuff about you two. Get the hint? Ayy! 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 What does Kara think of Metaton? Hand on hip, darling. He's always trying to get us to buy MTT brand clothes. <laughs> Blookie made this! I'm not complaining about it. There's one of those unnecessarily big chocolates in her Kara. <laughs> Are you crazy? Asriel throws another chocolate from above. <laughs> Here, Kara. Gives her a box of chocolate and an ice pack. Thanks. Whoa, bitch. Frisk, could you do something cute with Kara? Okay. Sweetie. Huh? <laughs> Gives Kara an umbrella to shield herself from all the chocolate. Frisk, I think Kara got hurt by a chocolate that got thrown at her. Maybe you could hug her to make her feel better. Huh? So, what is Frisk's reaction to Kara being pelted with chocolates? <laughs> Who are sending me these? Hey! Kara? You're beautiful. Throws a chocolate bar at her face, doing this with a big grin on my face. So who's more jealous? Would you call Fresca a bit overprotective? 
klinge. Uh, not at all. So, what do we do to get Frisk to calm down? Please calm down, Frisk. You, you of all people are scaring me here. Fucking hell. <laughs> I get it. You want a chocolate too, Frisk? Lightly tosses chocolate to Frisk, then hides in corner with knife. Please don't hurt me. <laughs> Do Frisk's tears glow? Oh, that felt like a rock. Kara, Fr Frisk is crying. I'm okay. I insist you two take the night off. Dr. Anon's orders. Um, it's 1.23, you little shit. <gasps> we need some fluff up in here. Cheers, Snuggles. I love this girl. Quickly as we go, Frisk, do that cute thing where you, whilst Kara is occupied reading this, come from behind and snuggle her hair, and in doing so, also lean over so the first thing Kara spots when she looks up is you. Psst! Use both eyes. Uh. <laughs> she smells really nice today. Give us a kiss, will ya? It's been a while. Hello? Frisk, have you ever thought of using some chocolate lipstick? Wink, wink. Hold still, Kira. What do you think of Frisk's butt? Uh, <laughs> Hella fine. Show me the booty. Can you draw Kara and Frisk with cat ears? <laughs> uh, I think they meant both of us in cat ears. But I ain't putting on that gay shit. Kara, make the cutest face possible. <laughs> Frisk, make the scariest face possible. G grr. Everybody do the flop. Everybody do the flop! What even? Places a sharp, unused kitchen knife in front of Kara. Care to make a dare? It's a knife. You use it for... Preparing stuff. It's usually food, but... <laughs> uh... Hey, Kara, what would you do if Frisk wore chocolate clothing? Why do you keep doing things that'll easily get you smacked? Points to butt grab and strap snap incidents. So Kara, was uh, getting smacked worth it or totally worth it? <laughs> it was so worth it. Hey Kara, Frisk is taking a shower now. <laughs> uh. Oh mama. Frisk, look behind you. Kara, do you not learn from your mistakes? <laughs> I'm fine, and no, because it's worth it. She's so cute when she's flustered. When oh my god, when are you two gonna get married? Oh, married. Oh, married. Oh, married. Oh, married. Oh, Congratulations to you guys, both to the man for their 1,000 followers and to Frisk and Kara for getting married. <laughs> Screams into the sun, my babies are getting married, bless. One day, when the sky is falling, I'll be Frisk. Hmm? 
standing right next to you. Yes! <laughs> hmm. Also, Kara is frisk still super ticklish. She is. Don't! Especially on her sides. Can you pronounce the Lenny face for Kara? Lenny does! <laughs> Do either of you watch Yuri? <laughs> we watch them together often. Alpha's approved DVDs. Kara, make the scariest face possible. <laughs> Shit, sorry. My bad. Didn't they kiss after the proposal? So, small curiosity, we've seen that Kara has a genocide mode, but what about Frisk? Does she even have a breaking point to her pacifism? And if so, what in the world might it look like? Also, this blog is the most precious thing. Frisk, please, run. JFC, stop trying to make me cry! Kara, get up! Get up! Answer me! Kara! Frisk, Kara, can we get a close-up of your rings on your fingers? Congrats, by the way! <laughs> Didn't you want to make me your wife? <laughs> this went from zero to a hundred real fucking quick. Now that, across the line! Frisk, wake up! You are having a nightmare! What the frack? Kara, no! Get up! Did you just- Please let Kara be okay. So... What happens now? Frisk... You're so ugly when you cry. <laughs> Sorry... I passed out for a- <laughs> So cool. So, cool. So, cool. so cool, so cool, so cool, so cool, so cool, so cool. You thought it was sand spamming, so cool. But it was actually. <sighs> you. Oh, Lottie, they're okay. Oh my gosh, it's okay, everyone, calm down. It's all good, right? Right? Phew. I was really worried. Yep, the duck has risen once again. She's alright, she just needs to rest. Remind me to fix up her necklace. Reminder to Frisk, fix Kara's necklace. Um, yep, that'll do! Well, at least you tried, Frisk. Uh, to Frisk, paint the bandages red so she doesn't notice. Uh... Super glue? Amalgamates, oh god! Duct tape, tape, glue and love is what you need. Maybe if you ask nicely, it will fix again. Wait, what? Use a power drill. Ew, uh... How about getting some help from someone who might actually know how to fix it? Oh, ask Grailby to heat it together. That should work, right? Right? Wow. 
Why don't you get Sans to take a look at it? He might know how to fix it. Uh, call Sans? Uh, call Mom? Uh, I'll call Alphys. Uh, <laughs> stupid. I'm sorry. I tried. I bet Kara loves Frisk so much because her skin is chocolatey. Uh, uh. Mm -hmm. Frisk and Kara, what do you like the most about each other? Her eyes, obviously. I love you, Kara. Uh. <laughs> What's with that all of a sudden? Your genuine smile. To watch Karen Frisk have kinky sex. <laughs> Go wash your soul. If I were to crawl into your house just for some warmth, what would you do? Flowly, what is your most favorite Pokemon? Oh, and one more thing. There are even Pokemon cards, if you likes. The Pokemon of Destruction! <laughs> Groudon is better. Please don't hurt me. Bro! So, do you guys will have a baby? I totally accept the fact that if Frisk and Kara were to have a magic baby, they would name them Coco for a girl, or Cacao for a boy, and they would have purple eyes. What would a Kara Frisk child look like? So, does this mean that Kara and Frisk will be having kids pretty soon? Do either of you would even want a child? Aside from Frowy, at least. for that. I mean, we can't... I... I... How are you going to celebrate the wedding? Or or if you have everything, please tell me I want to know! Have you guys had the wedding yet? Done. Ready for next month. I love it, Mom. What will Kara be wearing to the wedding? Wait, this one! No way! Stop! I'm imagining Sans is gonna destroy the wedding. What does Sans think about the wedding? How is Sans taking this news about the marriage? This one! Told you. As long as the kiddo's happy, I'm rooting for him. And I looks pretty excited for the wedding. Yeah, <laughs> heck yeah, it's gonna be awesome! They're perf- Stop it, Mom! Uh... <laughs> Seriously, kid? <laughs> Does Undyne remind you of your mom, Kara? Uh... Maybe? Honestly... I don't... Remember. Kara, you can't remember your parents? Your life before falling? Kara, what's about your dad? God don't tell me that he make you hate humanity. Undyne, quick! Hug slash crush your child! Kara, does someone need Frisk's embrace? No, I'm fine, really. Yet. It's just weird that I can't remember. My parents? Does Frisk remember her parents? I never knew my parents. I grew up at an orphanage before my fall. Kara, 
Make love to Fritz. Go wash yourself. Yeah. Take Frisk and push them against the wall. And show Frisk some affection. Frick, frick, frick! Let some good sin. <laughs> Have fun, girls. <laughs> now go make the babies. <laughs> A sin? Flowey, we need to see. Maybe we were. But Flowey wasn't. <laughs> now get out! Trying to play video games here. So, Kara, have you ever thought you might have repressed memories at one point? Be good. Okay? I... don't recall? We all know one of you wants a baby. Frisk? Hmm? I think you'd make a great mom. Uh. Not at all. N no, not cut out for it. Hey, Carol, what video games do you like? What about Frisk? Gap it! <laughs> Have you guys tried Kingdom Hearts? If you spike Kara's hair, they could cosplay as Sora! Uh, uh-huh. I'm pretty lame with gaming compared to Kara and Flowey. Video games, huh. Oh, oh, Kara, play Dark Souls, I dare you! <laughs> Kara, have you ever played Bloodborne or Dark Souls? But Since we're talking about video games, I thought you might be able to enjoy the muses reacting to the game that they come from Undertale. Play it, break the fourth wall. Play Undertale or check out Dreamer Reborn Kara's Boss Fight XD. <laughs> you might want to be careful, Frisk. Kara might still be unpredictable. She might be trying to use you, just like she used Asriel. <laughs> huh? Uh, you okay? Frisk, don't you doubt Kara. If she wanted to use you, she wouldn't put her life on the line to protect you from those assaults. Plus, she wouldn't have asked to marry you, and I don't think you have anything to worry about. Don't be scared. I love you, and I'd love you a million times over. Trust me, okay? I trust you with all my heart. What are your favorite movies? <laughs> uh, Princess Mononoke, Spirited Away, Wolf Children, Kakurembo, House Moving Castle, Whisper of the Heart, Children Who Chase Lost Voices. <laughs> When's the baby coming? <gasps> Guys, come on! It's biologically impossible for us to have a child, and I'm not cut out to be a mom in the last stop it! <laughs> no, Frisk, stop worrying about being a mom. I'm sure you'll be great if you take your mind off it. Here's a big fluffy blanket for you and Kara to share and cuddle right now, because cuddles make everything feel better. Uh, thanks for understanding. We just don't feel ready to raise a child yet. And thank you for the blanket! Karith as Titus X, you know, lol. Shuyin and Lin. The anti-monster grabs Frisk and grits darkly, taking her hostage. With a swift movement, they took her soul, cracking it. Oops! <laughs> <laughs> the other side! 
on the right. Go left. Frisk, why didn't you tell me? Crushes Frisk's soul. Anti-monster steps in front of Kara. Uh, uh, uh. If you keep being naughty, you won't get to see her in her final moments. <laughs> um, I'm curious. Flowey, why do you care? You're helping Kara, but why? You don't have a soul and thus can't care. What is driving you to help Kara and Frisk? Because. because. She saved us all. Is Sanson on dine helping Kara get Frisk back? Kara, look out! That one's got a gun! Uh <laughs> all there is is white noise. Frisk doesn't realize their eyes are shut until she has to pry them open. The ropes around her are now easy to get out of. Easy enough. She begins to stand, but the lack of food, water, and loss of blood gives her a pounding headache. Extreme dizziness overcomes her senses as she falls forward, forgetting to put her arms out. But she doesn't need to. Someone is already there to catch her, embrace her, love her until the day she dies. Why didn't you tell us, Frisk? That they threatened to attack the wedding if you didn't come. Why'd you go alone? Idiot. You idiot. Uh, Frisk, you alright? How's your injuries? Damn those anti-monsters. Jamley places the deluxe chocolate bar on top of Kara's head. Is Frisk recovering comfortably? <laughs> Yeah, she's okay. Look. Thanks again for giving her the fluffy blanket. She really likes it. Also, please stop stacking shit on my head, please. Stacks bars of chocolate on Kara's head to a ridiculous height. LMAO, now you won't be able to move without it all falling on you! Can you not? So, Kara. How is Frisk in bed? Uh, uh. Good to see you again, Frisk. Want some green tea? Call in Ah, hello again! Thanks for visiting so often. I'm much better now, thank you! Have any of you thought of having long hair? Yeah, I've been thinking about letting my hair grow long. What do you guys think, should I? Uh, the ask I want to do is too big, so I'll ask this instead. First, if you do want children, regardless of how, do you have any preferences? Boy, girl, number, or kids? Same question to Kara, in case they want to share as well. Uh, a, a girl! Uh. I've been thinking if Toriel is Frisk at Kara's mother, wouldn't that make them sisters? Have I crossed the line? Excuse you, she's my baby fish now! Get out, Mom! Hey, character, have you ever drank any type of alcohol since you're like 23? Uh. Couldn't someone just photoshop two different pictures of Frisk having a child open? <gasps> How would Kara react to zombie Frisk? Sort of some Walking Dead type stuff? Black. Uh. Carl, look! A cute walker! Ugh, you're gonna get bit! We love The Walking Dead! Just caught up with season 6 this week! But I still can't pull off being scary. I've noticed that Frisk has a similar muscular tone to Kara. Kara spars with Undyne, so I assume that's how she keeps dat muscle. So does Frisk exercise with Papyrus, or do they have an exercise regime with someone else? <laughs> She's really capable of fighting, to be honest. It's just that she's such a big pacifist. Wait, so that makes Alphys her mother too? 
Golden cereal? Baby fish. Oh, go away! Family hug! <laughs> Alphys, do you have some machine or invention that could give us an idea on what Frisking Kara's child would look like? C can you guys keep a secret? These are two kids from the orphanage. Kara and Frisk have been going over to see them a lot lately. I have no doubt. They can make great parents. I guess we will see. <sighs> Alphys, show us one time from when they visited those kids. <laughs> <laughs> About the long hair, I got an idea. Wear a long wig, the sexiest you can find. And pose with them as a surprise in front of Kara. Depending on her reaction, you can choose whether or not you want them to grow long. Colon D. Kara! How do I look? <coughs> uh, Kara? Hey, Alphys, what's the name of those kids? Uh, hi guys. Weird question, but you guys got any suggestions for boy-girl names? <laughs> boy, Adrian. Girl, Caroline. Asriel for the boy? I mean, you don't have to if it upsets Kara, but just thought it'd be a nice way for her to move on. Uh, the boy could be named Asriel, Kara's way of honoring her brother. A positive way to look at things instead of looking at what happened in the past. Looking at the wonderful life she has the opportunity to live? Uh... <laughs> um, when you guys sleep, does one of the two of you snore? If so, how loudly? Stop! Uh, say... Stop! Is there any chocolate? Uh. I am really quiet in my sleep, actually. Kara doesn't snore, but she talks in her sleep sometimes. If that counts. A picture of Carolyn and Asriel arrives in Frisk and Kara's inbox. They are tied up to chairs with several men wearing masks and cloaks surrounding them. Two of them hold a knife to their throats each. Another holds up a sign. Come and get them. If you hurt my wife and my children... <laughs> We throw stuffed animals at the children. <laughs> Stop throwing things, guys! Family photo time! Colin D. Little picture of you two and the kids. Uh, I would like to see some Zen. Thanks you very much. Take it out. But the water's cold. That's okay. It'll warm you up in a bit. Sin, 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 sin! Oh, that's some good sin. Mm, yep, there it is, right there, right there. Kara, what does this all taste like? Uh, not that I'm complaining, but exactly how are we seeing this footage? <laughs> <laughs> how old are the kids? Eight! Oh, she's eight, I'm nine. And yeah, you can hug us. Ask her parents' permission first, though. What are the kids' opinions on clowns? <laughs> They're cool! Uh... Oh, oh, I've got a good one! Do the kids like to read? Uh... <laughs> uh, hey, Kara, Frisk, can I ask the kids something? Don't worry, I'll behave. So, Kara, Ireland, Asriel, how is it to have two moms instead of a dad and a mom? Papa! Doo doo! Uh, we don't mind. I know it's a bit early. I mean, the kids are just arrived and all. But I was wondering what they would look like when they grow up. I'm curious. I want to be a teacher at Grandma Toriel's monster school. Carolyn says she wants to be, a uh, um, I'm not sure. She keeps saying stars. How did Kara and Frisk's first kiss look like? Frisk? Thank you. I owe you my life and more for giving me another chance to live. Oh, it's no big. Will you be my girlfriend? I'd be happy to. Flowey! Can I hug you? <laughs> <laughs> Kara, 
Kara, do you ever wake up at random times of the night and just space out and think about something? <laughs> yeah, I think about the beautiful girl sleeping beside me. Have you guys ever played Life is Strange? Yes, we have. It's one of our favorite. Kara, spit that out! It's just paper. Can Kara finally tell Frisk she's sexy? Of course. Frisk, I think you're s s stupid. Ah! Uh, again? Frisk, go to Kara and tell her she is sexy. Kara, <laughs> you're really sexy. <coughs> Wife, too cute to have mercy, please. You're not fucking babies. You can't just rename them. Like halfway through your life, you're just like, nah, bruh. Take on a different name. And my children. I'm about to bust a nut. Take it out. Take it out. Oh, oh. This is some not safe. Oh, God. <laughs> oh, Jesus. That's the only sound effect I'm giving you for that. See, she's eight, I'm nine. How the fuck are you gonna give eight and nine-year-olds new fucking names? Like, you just, it's like, oh, hello, Jimmy. Guess what? You're not fucking Jimmy anymore. And then every time he says his old name, you spray him with, like, a little spritz bottle. I'm not sure. She keeps saying stars. Oh, she wants to be me. Well, look, listen here, you little bitch. I've already claimed this fucking territory. So, <laughs> thank you. <coughs> Already calling each other wife? D colon. But we didn't get to see the wedding! Damn those anti monster extreme mists. I wanted to see you beautiful people in your wedding outfits! So. When's the wedding? May I attend the wedding? Have you guys had the wedding yet? So when's the wedding itself? So when's the wedding? Hey! Hey! <laughs> Promise me that you'll be with me forever. With my heart and soul. I've seen enough of this vlog to know something bad's going to happen. My god. Oh god, please let nothing bad happen. Please! Why do I have a weird feeling that something terrible is about to happen? Do you know how hard it is to steal a single one of these? Kara, can I tell you something? You really do make me happy. Believe us, please! They are coming to kill all of you! I think one of them is hiding in the crowd! <laughs> what are we gonna do? What happened to our guards? Kara Frisk! Be careful. I don't sense them. The intruder too. We have to stop the wood- I would offer help, but I'm merely an observer that I cannot exactly intervene. I wish you the best of luck, Sans, Undyne, Frisk, and Kara. Can the girls not be happy and sick for one day? Well! We're all fucked. No, it just can't be happening. Oh god, is everybody okay? Watch out! Kara. It smells like raspberries. Baby fist! <laughs> no wonder I couldn't sense the intruder. Eat that, Kara! Uh. Give Frisk Kingdom Hearts 3 as your wedding present. Colon 3! <gasps> Kara, cancel the honeymoon! Huh? Oh, okay. What? I have a question.
question for Kara. Do you like to draw like a lot of people say? Uh, not really. Does Frisk draw? If so, what, in honest opinion, is the best one? <laughs> Holy. I'll give this to you if you'd like. Don't forget to pick up Mom's cake for Azriel. Yes, babe. Tell Carolyn I'm getting Animal Crossing for her today, too. Alright, guys. Let's go visit the kids. I don't trust you, Mon. What's happening? Wait, is that orphanage arc in the tag at the latest? Oh, still God, I'm scared. My instinct tells me that angst will happen this weekend. Hello? Anyone there? It's Frisk. Hello? Carolyn? Azriel? Mommy's here. Are you there? Frisk, run! No. Not until I find them. Hurting Kara? She can take it and Frisk is at worst, but targeting children? That's low. Really low. 21... 22 children dead. How could they do this? Carolyn? Hasriel? Answer me. Not trying to be a downer, but I think the kids are dead or hurt. <laughs> Mommy chased them away! So, please answer me! <laughs> Somebody give this woman her kids back, please! You, Carolyn, and Azriel coming out of hiding from the anti monsters! Give them love. <sighs> oh, my babies. I, th I thought I lost you. Oh, God. Have Frisk and Kara ever gotten into a fight? Frisk, look. I'm sorry. You told me to pick up. Sorry? I 22 children and the caretakers were killed! I wonder what happens when you push a truly peaceful person to violence. You weren't there when I needed you most! Frisk, be reasonable. You're just stressed out, shaken by what happened. Don't take it out on Kara. Frisk, come on, that's not fair to her. The kids were in danger, and where were you? Getting a stupid video game for them? So, just wondering, how is it that you're, like, kind of corporeal and alive, Kara? Because technically you've been dead for a certain number of years, and that could be centuries. Like, how'd you end up piloting a meat suit again? <sighs> Tell me, what in this entire blog was it mentioned that I'm alive or human? Psst, Carolyn, cheer up your daddy for us, will you? <laughs> Come on, Carolyn, make silly faces! Bucka, 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 Carolyn, Asriel, you've seen your parents cosplay, right? Well, who would you guys cosplay as? Mommy prepared these for us last time. Chihiro and Haku from one of our favorite movies, Spirited Away. Asriel, go cheer up your mommy while sis cheers up dad. You gotta get them happy. I can't see them being mad at each other. What should I do? Guys? Asriel, mom needs cuddles. And maybe puns. You have your mission. Go, go, go! Tell her a story. Hey, Mommy. How does a train eat? It goes choo-choo. <laughs> Kara, you need to understand that Frisk went through something very traumatizing by herself, and she's on the edge right now. How you reacted didn't show much concern, and Frisk really needs someone right now. Also, Frisk, you have to understand, it's not Kara's fault. She was only trying to get something nice for the kids, and she had no idea this was gonna happen. You know that if she knew, she would have been there right away. Please, Makeup. 
You two love each other. Don't do this. Kara, wait. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to take it out on you. I love you, okay? Have a Niner Sands ever babysat the kids? If they haven't, I think they would enjoy it. Uh, I'm too young to be your grandma, so call me, uh, um, Flava! Okay, if you want. Frisk, can I have the Mononoke painting you did? Ooh. Uh, sorry, I already gave it away to the asker. You can have the one I just finished if you'd like. It was supposed to be for Carolyn, but I don't mind doing another. Wait, Kara is not a human! Kara, if you're Are you scared of me? Wait, Kara, you like a monster or something? How did you come to be again? Was it Frisk who did it? Well, first off, I've never shown you guys my soul, have I? Hundreds and thousands of genocide loops. Never-ending nightmares I couldn't escape. Hundreds and thousands of frisks. And only this one... saved me. Uh, hey, Kara, how many frisks did you kill? And why is this the lucky one? I don't know. There were so many of them. All different, but all scared of me. So, they fought. I don't remember how many I had to fight him for how many years, but I'll always remember the last one. Pushes the girls close together. <laughs> Um, have Kara and Frisk ever physically fought? <laughs> uh, Frisk, before we- <coughs> uh. I'm so sorry! You weren't ready! <laughs> it's okay. Your punch improved a lot, though. Kinda, yeah. I mean, we train together at home when Fishball Mom is too busy. Um, Azrael, bring Mommy some ice! Uh, did you hit Daddy again? Yes, and mommy feels bad! OMG, I just realized Frisk wears your red and green. I can only see Kara wearing hers, but where is yours? Oh my god, are you cheating? We both wear them on our left hands. Uh, don't yell at my wife like that. <laughs> it's okay. Frisk, I'm so jealous of you. You're so hot. Q underscore Q. Uh. Uh. <laughs> Frisk, you're staring at me again. <laughs> Sorry. Psst, Frisk! Do you know anything about Kara's secret? Um, what secret? Whispers, I'm the secret that Kara's been seeing another girlfriend behind your back. No, I'm just kidding, Frisk. Don't take this seriously, please. Uh, she what? Oh my god, damn it, Anna, don't listen to them, Frisk. It's a filthy goddamn lie. Kara loves you and no one else. Um, the person was joking. They would never do that to you. Frisk, they were just kidding. <laughs> yeah, good one, Anna. <laughs> good reaction, right? You move over to the other Frisk and quickly give her a hug. No one should be teased like that. Kara, your wife needs your love. Now. Mm. <sighs> you still look ugly when you cry. Come on, we have a date. <laughs> I sound like the fucking kid from Dor the whale speak. Ow! Stole away from the pipes! <laughs> Sexy romantic! I'll always remember the last one. Cause she's my wife! What have you got? A knife! No! That's a good vine. Uh. Oh, Frisk, before we- <coughs> 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 Oh, just 
saying. See it, mm, girl. I was saying. Not into it, but I like the ass. That's all I'm saying. Are you happy with my reaction? Or... You want something else? What more are you gonna take from me? Don't do it! I'm pretty sure I know what those noises are. Don't do it! <laughs> I think Frisk and Kara should take the kids and run far, far away! Um, guys! Stay alert! They know where you live! Send a secret message to Undyne and Sans without that anti-monster looking. Um, Frisk and Kara and the kids need your help now. Sans, another genocide is coming. Uh... We've been getting a lot of blank asks lately. <laughs> More blank asks. Yeah, lame! If something bad enough were to happen, could the anti-monsters take control of Kara almost like a puppet? Would she have to try and break away with determination? I mean, what about Frisk also? Uh, I don't want to control either of them. I want to kill them. Slowly and painfully. Excuse me, anti-monster miss, but I'm sure you're aware that they have combined the most determination. They can reset at any time and never truly die. Do you have a plan for that or? Message to the anti-monsters. You hurt any of them? We will stop at nothing to destroy you. Hey, how did the date go, Kalitri? Where did you two go, Kalitri? Uh, 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 um, uh, sorry. Oh, my hand! There's a cut on my hand. Uh. I'll see you both soon. In the last genocide. Um, Mark used to be anti-monster. Maybe he can help? Oh, I never wanted to be in that cult. Thousands of us didn't. I'm safer being a ghost. It's that crazy lady. She threatened us too. You have no idea. What a monster she is! Please tell me the kids are okay! <laughs> <laughs> um, Kara, was there any survivors during the genocide loop that you may have not killed off besides your frisk? Just injured. about an exciting turn of events, huh? Even one such as myself is surprised knowing of the things that are and will be. Now, who should go first? Um, hey Asriel, things might look bleak in the future, but keep your hopes up. Remember this, even now, there are people that love you. Little Caroline, you are a fierce one to be sure, but don't forget to cherish those closest to you. Oy vey! Running out of room here. Frisk Kara, your great parents. Don't stop running with it. They know where you live, run! Hey, mommy? Yes, sweetie? Smart kid. You too, mun. Azriel's gonna make a great teacher someday. Now, where do we go from here? Could you come here for a while? Okay, just let me clear up the room a bit. Okay. Oh, my gee, Azriel, look behind you! Frisk Kara, help your child! Azriel, I and don't look back, she's going to kill you. <laughs> uh, what? Behind me? So has Carolyn tried telling her mommy and daddy about what she saw? Yes, the kids told us. Thank you everyone for warning us. And we're back everyone! So you guys have seen the anti-monster leader, right? Huh? Her? 
Oh no, we've only seen her on the news, or on the newspaper. I don't think she's ever shown up in person in front of us. Kara, what's with that look? Kara. Sweetie? Kara? Do you want to say something? You know me, don't you? Yes, tell her, Kara, dear. <laughs> Kara? Uh, um, Kevin and Nazriel, Daddy needs a hug! Is there something you want to talk about, sweetie? No. Wait, where is Azriel? Here! Hi, everyone! I'll be staying with the girls until the threat settles down. Leave it to Mom, Dine! Undyne, maybe you could talk to Kara. She's been looking pretty down lately. Colon. <gasps> Baby fish. I'm fine, Mom. <laughs> Kara? What are you? I'm a... baby fish. I'm a baby fish. Oh, 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 oh. You get that baby, and you get that fish, and you put them together what you get a baby fish. <laughs> oh, I never wanted to be in that cult. Thousands of us didn't. I'm safer being a ghost. <laughs> that does not correct. <laughs> Mark used to be anti-monster. Maybe he can help. Just delete that on toes. Um, excuse me, anti-monster miss, but you can't sit here. Actually, um, Amelia, I can't sit anywhere. I have determination. Delete, delete that. 